Hello guys, I'm Mel from Thailand. I'm Brock. Today we are going to Angsila Seafood by Yadai. If you enjoy seafood, this is a must see and have seafood restaurant. Authentic Thai food. Seafood. Very, very nice. It's near Mega Bunga, the large shopping centre in Bangkok, which is near Sawinapum International Airport. That's the airport you probably came in on. Anyway, if you haven't subscribed to Thailand Unplugged, give it a go. You might like it. You never know. This is Radio Thailand News. Radio Thailand News. Going today, you know? So we're going to the Nook birthday party. Nook's your friend. My isn't friend, it? yes. Your friend. At um, Sila Seafood by Janja near Mekabanga. How do you say it? Anja. Huh? Angela. Ang Sila Seafood. Ang Sila Seafood. Yes. Mm -hmm. How old is she? My friend. Yeah. Why you want to know? You went to school with it and tell everybody what your age is. <laughs> 54. Oh, you said it. Near 55. Mal's 55. Yes. So he thinks she's 35. And oh, one way. guy said to me, um, on the thing, how does an old guy like you get a young chick like that? I just, I didn't tell him. I said, no, she's not that much uh, younger than me. Anyway, what's today's Sunday, isn't it? Yeah. I make some um, uh, blueberry pie for her. Yeah? Yes. It's nice. Homemade. Burgery. Homemade. Yeah. Oh, that'd be good. Yeah, just now you know that. You have maybe two before. I didn't. You have in the morning. Don't lie, you're still. I haven't been here before this restaurant. <laughs> oh, at the Anxila, no, never. That should be good. Mm -hmm. Oh, I never go there. You really are an expert driver, Mel, you know that? Yes. I feel so safe with you driving. Bumpy roads along here. Mm. Safe for shooting. Huh? Safe for children. Why? You know... That's safe for children, bumpy roads. Uh, yeah, because uh, the car must to slow down, you know. And motorbike in Thailand, you know, they go very, very uh, far. Privacy. Yeah, they're very they bad. They do not? They're still, I know. In Australia, they have speed humps. It's a hump in the road, so uh -huh. you got to slow down. you got them here too, some places. They work quite well. Oh. Slows them down, you know. Uh, yeah, they're all ma maniacs in Australia. They go through, you know, they, they, um, the young ones, they just don't know what they're doing. You know, and they're, they're expert drivers when they get their license, you know, when they're 18 years old. I don't know about Thailand. In, in, in Australia, they, they give you a P plate, pr probationary, to P. They put it on the back of your car. Do they do that in Thailand? Yeah, never. They don't, they just give them, they don't. So you don't know if this guy set his license for, for one day? You don't know. I know, I don't know. Oh my God, they should change that. Oh. We, they got to wear the P plates for a year, I think. Oh, mm. really? No, yeah, they, they, they don't have in Thailand. They have to display a big P on the back of their car, oh, probationary. Oh, I think it's for... And then they change the colour, I think. I'm, oh, I'm not sure. Uh, I can't remember. Uh, and, um, yeah, they, they're going to drive around for a year, so you know they haven't had their licence uh, long. And uh, when you're in Australia, you see a P-plate driver, you see a P-plate driver cutting you off, uh, 
and then sticking his finger up, you know, like this at you with a pea plate, you think, oh my god. Oh, now, now, sometimes, uh, then it's not honor, you know, maybe it's uh, the car of the pallet, pallet. Yeah. yeah, and sometimes they, they, they use, you know, sometimes they drive, but sometimes uh, uh, sister, mother, father drive the same car, the, then the, they don't put, I don't know, it's no idea. In Australia, when, Maybe when, good. in Australia, if you drive that car, you must display P plates. It's a mm. big P. It's mm. about a, mm -hmm. well, it's not really, uh, about eight inches. About that big, mm. and they've got to stick mm -hmm. it there. Mm. They stick them on the window. Ah, uh, let's see far, far away. You can yeah. see. Yeah. And when you're learning to drive a car, they have one that's got a, a big L, same size. It's, it's uh -huh. an L. That uh -huh. means learner. Uh -huh. And you, I don't know how long they have them for when they're going for their license uh -huh. until they get it. You're teaching them how to drive. It's a good idea. It's a good system. Pretty good system. Yeah. Yes. Anyway, back to the restaurant. You've never been here before? I've been there for long times ago. Mm. Oh, that's nice. Maybe eight years ago. Oh. Mm. Yeah, I'll see what happens. It's nice seafood. Uh, I've been there like at the old, less long now. So they move out the bigger. Say that again. I've been there for the first less salon, very small. They they do at house. Yeah, they do less salon at his at the ten house. Oh really? On the house? Yeah, but now one second Mel. Oh really the house? Yes. But That'd now like uh Slum Cosmo as a good sale. And uh then the, they move outside and the Build a big less along now. I, I ne never been the uh, after they build the new one. I read a couple of reviews on the place, mm -hmm. <clears throat> the restaurant we're going to. They, it gets a very good review. Mm -hmm. They yes. say it's cheap and good food. I'm not sure that's a uh, cheap, but good food is yes. Oh, that'll be good. Lazy Sunday. Hello there, if you are watching these videos, could you please help us out and push the subscribe button or click on the subscribe button if you like. It helps us out a hell of a lot. Be most appreciated. And now back to the video. Yeah. Very professional. She's having a go at me because I brought the GoPro and everything with me and didn't have it charged. There's a restaurant there. Parking. Hmm. Hard to get across here. Everybody's in a hurry in Thailand. What? I don't know what that says. It looks okay. Okay. They're inside, I'll just finish this mic and go in. Yeah, it looks like a pretty good restaurant. And there we go. There's the address there with its phone number and everything there. Yeah, we'll go and have a look around. It's good. Sorry, Clark. You've got all little rooms uh, around the. Um, it's an it's a house. It used to be a house, and you turn it into a, a restaurant. It's Ansala Seafood. That's the name of it. Very nice. 
Hello. Beautiful, look at that. Should have read the title there. You sit there if you want. You see that? Hello. Oh, you finished already, huh? Wait. Fresh prawns. Got everything here. <laughs> I'm not sitting near Mel today because it's too dangerous. It's everything. This is crab. My favorite thing. Yeah. Thailand called Gan Chiang Phu. Gang Som. Deep Boy. Som Gang Pha Paya. Ah, this is my favorite tea. Yeah. Ah, this is my favorite tea. Ah, this is my no, it's not, it's a prawn. Freshwater prawn or freshwater bull. <laughs> Hurry up, Mel. We'll be here for 10 minutes filming it. Okay. It's nice. It's my hand. Oh, a bit of mine, I think, in the sauce. What did say? You're making me no ice to beer, beer? No ice. Yeah. You see? Look at that. Expert. See, that's, that's the difference in Thailand and Australia. They actually serve you. In Australia, they throw the bottle. It's all mine, you see? Say you cook there on Monday. Oh, oh. What about these things? Can you do that?
food's fantastic here. Yes. This is uh, pineapple ice cream. Very good idea. Let's put ice cream in here. It tastes very good. It's actually pineapple, isn't it? Yes. Good night. Nice. Yeah. Try a bit. Yeah. Oh, you've got to try it here. This one I flex. ครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับครับคร